Hello, Jason here from septictank.co.uk and today's video is entitled Septic Tank Installation Cost. So in this video, I'm going to show you which is the best and most cost effective septic tank to buy. I'm also going to show you which is the best and most cost effective soak away to buy. Right? I'm going to show you whether it's easier and more cost effective to get someone else to do it or it's cheaper to do it yourself. Okay, so the total cost of what it's going to cost you to install a septic tank and soak away are going to be based on the two most popular selling septic tanks in the UK. And that is the onion style septic tank and the bullet shape low profile septic tank. All right, so it's going to be based on those two tanks and then all the bits and bobs that go with that septic tank to give you the complete septic tank and soak away. So let's do a price comparison, all right, like for like. All right, so I'm basing this on a septic tank that's going to cater for three to four bedrooms, okay? So that's an approximation. I mean, that's the average size of bedrooms uh, that most people buy septic tanks for. So yours could be five to six bedrooms, seven to eight bedrooms, one to two bedrooms, okay? But the point is you'll get an idea, right? An overall picture of what it's basically gonna cost you to install a septic tank and soak away, all right? So let's start with the cost of an onion shape or style septic tank. So typically to buy a septic tank, um, for three to four bedrooms will cost you 899 quid, all right? Then there's gonna be VAT on that, all right? For the bullet-shaped septic tank, it's gonna be roughly the same, 899 pounds plus the VAT, all right? So it's pretty much level, all right, so far. But with the onion-shaped septic tank, there's some additional extra bits that you need if you're going to install it. The first thing is concrete. Because of the shape of them, they're like um, a light bulb, you've got to put a concrete blanket around them. If you don't do it, it null and voids the warranty from the manufacturer. So it's something you have to do, right? It's not an optional extra. And even on something like the three to four bedroom tanks, there's gonna be a minimum cost that you're gonna to have to spend on concreting. And that cost is roughly gonna be about 800 quid. All right, so that's minimum, but let's keep keep it to minimum realistic figures here. Okay, so you're going to spend out a minimum 800 quid to anchor the um, septic tank in the hole. If you don't, they've got a, a habit or a danger of popping out the ground. Secondly, before you put the concrete blanket around it, you've got to put an anchor kit around it. It's like a belt and braces. So you've got braces and at the bottom of the tank is a lintel. Now, those anchor kits, they roughly cost about 300 quid. Now, all this is, is not including the VAT. So 800 plus 300, if my maths is correct, you've got 1,100 quid. Additionally, to add to that figure of 899, with the low profile septic tanks, you don't need any concrete. They're designed for granular backfill. So on this one, you don't need, um, as I said, concrete, but you do need uh, shingle or gravel. So if I put shingle or gravel here, and typically it costs about 400 quid for the shingle or gravel, 20 to 30 mil shingle or gravel for a low profile septic tank. All right, digger. Now, digger, digger-wise, for the onion-shaped septic tanks, they're about 12 foot in height, and so you need a big digger with some guts. So you're talking about a minimum of a three-ton digger here. Personally, I like to go for a five or a seven-ton digger. So let me go for a three to five-ton digger, all right? So typically, it'll take you about two days to dig the hole for the onion tank. And as an average, last time I looked, with the fuel and everything like that, all right, these are plus VAT by the way, it's gonna cost you about 500 quid plus VAT for the week, that includes the juice that you'll use and you'll probably go through about two or three jerry cans of juice. Now the digger for the low profile tanks, there's a lot smaller footprint, a lot smaller hole that you need. And so you can go for a three ton digger on those and they literally take about an hour 
or two hours to install. And the diggers literally will cost you about 300 quid plus VAT for the week because you'll just use a tank of juice if that. Um, and yeah, you don't need as much guts. All right, so pipe work, typically and an inspection chamber for um, either of these septic tanks is going to be around. I mean, the inspection chambers are about 150 quid. So I've put 150 there. The pipe work, um, three meter lengths are normally like 20 quid. So let's say you went for five of those. So let's say that was 100. So we can put about 250 quid there for the pipe work um, and the inspection chamber. Now, this is where the biggest difference comes, the type of soak away. For the onion style septic tanks, because the outlet pipe is so low down on them, you're talking about a minimum of three meters or more, right? Uh, a, a minimum of one meter, which is three foot or more, then you need a herringbone type of soak away. Now, a herringbone type of soak away, literally you dig a massive uh, hole not the size of a football field, but getting on that size, you've got to put a shingle bed on there, you've got to put the pipes on top of it, you've got to put the membrane on top of that, you've got to put more shingle, and it takes typically about two to three days to put the herringbone soak away in. And so the pipes, the shingle, and the connectors, typically for a herringbone system, it's nuts, man. Flip a neck. You can safely say, right, safely say it's going to cost you a minimum, minimum of 1,500 quid plus the VAT, right, for that kind of soak away, plus the time factor. For the low profile septic tank, yes, you can call me bias here, but I've been doing this 20 years. I know what uh, lots of uh, septic tank installation companies use now, and most of them all, all go for these septic tank soak away crates. And it's not surprising they take about an hour to install and um, they're a hell of a lot cheaper. So typically, uh, septic tank soak away crates for a three to four bedroom house is about 699 plus the VAT. All right. So look, time wise, time wise, typically it will take you a week to put an onion style septic tank in. The bullet shaped septic tank take you about a day, two days maximum. In fact, the longest time it takes with the low profile ones is to tidy the garden back up. But let me get my calculator a second. All right, so let's add this up now. All right, so we've got uh, we've got eight nine nine. Let's add this up first. We've got eight nine nine plus one thousand one hundred. We've got five hundred quid. We've got two hundred and fifty pounds, and we've got fifteen hundred quid for the soak away. So we're looking at four two nine forty nine times one point two, which is the VAT. So typically, right on this and this, yeah, pretty much. spot on there it's going to cost you five thousand and ninety eight pound and 80p for the onion shaped septic tank so let's see how much it's going to cost you for the low profile right you got 899 you got 400 you got 300 you got 250 and you got 699 times 1.2 equals there you go look at that 3057 and 60p so it pretty much turned out as I thought it would. I mean, I've been, as I said, installing for 20 years and technology has advanced so much since the days of the old herringbone systems and the onion style septic tank system. So look, you can see there it's 2000 at least. This is a minimum, right? It's at least 2000 quid cheaper for the low profile septic tanks. And as I said before, that's not including time wise, right? It takes you, it'll take you at least a week, seven days to put an onion shaped septic tank in. Massive holes, massive holes for the soak away and the septic tank. The footprint for the, for the low profile uh, septic tank and soak away, the crates. I mean, the footprint, something like nine foot by 12 foot by one and a half foot deep for the soak away. For the septic tank, I mean, the hole takes an hour to dig. So personally, yes, call me biased, but personally, because I install myself, since these this technology came out, that's what I lean to every single time. And for that reason, not only is it easy and quick to install, but, you know, it costs a lot less. So I also said at the outset, is it cheaper to put your own septic tank in or get a firm to do it? Well, typically, the going rate for a company, if you get three quotes in from three companies, they'll charge you anywhere from eight to twelve thousand pounds, right, to put a septic tank and soak away in for you. I 
recommend to people to buy um, a septic tank and soak away kit. Yes, you can get them from septictank.co.uk, but the point is you can get them for like, uh, for neck, starting, I think they start at 1,500 quid for the one to two bedroom houses. But the point I'm making is, is that you can get your builder or your groundsman to do it and he'll charge you 500 quid or a thousand to do it. So literally for three, four grand, you can, <laughs> you can purchase and get your builder to install your own septic tank system. So there you go. I hope, hope these costings have helped. Their figures are current with based on the um, current prices of things. But look, every little helps. And, and uh, for me, if you've got an extra two grand in your pocket, two grand's a lot of money in this day and age to have over. You can spend it on your wife or treat yourself to something. So listen, thank you very much for watching this video today. If you'd like to see more of me, then just go to septictank.co.uk. You'll see loads of other free videos I've done, which will give you more free help and advice. Or if you go onto Google or YouTube and type in Septic Tank TV, you'll see my Septic Tank TV channel. If you've subscribed, subscribe to it you'll get loads of uh, free videos giving more free help and advice so listen thank you very much for watching this video today you take care and i'll speak to you soon for more information just click the link below this video or visit septictank.co.uk for free help and advice